five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Girls be girls. Whatever. Wait, why girls gotta be girls too? Hold on, yeah, wait a second. Hey, come on. Let's hold on, wait a minute. We brought two seemingly different groups of people into our studio to see if they could unite in a one-of-a-kind dance challenge. What is your favorite dance move? Um, mine's a dance hall move. It's called Nalinga. Oh. And just like. Hey. 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 Yeah. Hey. Hey. Okay, hold on. If I were to come in here, just Yes! Like Ooh! <laughs> I love that. Just do a little Ooh. wiggle. Hey. 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 This one. Yes! If I'm limber enough, it's the like... What? Ah! Oh, you know? On. It's kind of like... Uh. Do you know what you're going to be doing here today? No. Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> Choreographing something or freestyling because that's what a they usually make us do. A little little yeah. freestyle. Oh, wait, how about freestyle? Today you'll be working together to choreograph a 60 second dance routine <gasps> to a song that I'll be giving you. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. okay, let's do it. I'm okay, done. okay. Excited. Yeah, we're we're let's so do it. excited. <laughs> so you'll only have 30 minutes to choreograph and practice before the final. Okay. Yes, <laughs> we're ready. Okay. The bigger, the better. Hey! hey. Oh. Hi. 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 How's it going? I'm Cleo. Kyle. Hi, I think. Kyle. It was a good and bad thing. I was like, so you gave dancers dancers, but I realized that they were all like, hello. And I was like, oh no, they're technical dancers. Brandon. I'm not that surprised just because it is kind of a popular thing to do like ballet and hip hop because there is a difference. There is a line. It is two different trainings. This is going to be either really funny or just plain awkward. I was expecting, like, my mom or something. I was <laughs> like... All right, team. This is your song. It's a little swing. <gasps> oh, it is swing! <laughs> I still wish I had a little bit more, like, hip-hop in me, just because, like, when you're at the club and the hip-hop dancers are going down, you can't just be, like, you know, like, Batma. Mm. Okay. Can I have that track after? I'm a light. Yeah. <laughs> Your time oh. starts in three, <laughs> two, oh. one. Okay. <laughs> <All right. laughs> what are we doing? What are we doing? Right, um, let's start it. Uh, so, almost something like introductory, where it's like, because it sounds like there's almost like a thing in the music where you could hit on focus on every one of us. But well, it has two beats in the beginning, so we can hold, like... Um, I like that there's two girls, and the voice can come to the windows. You can go, bump, T, 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 T. Ooh, yeah. okay. Okay, so, T. Yeah. Five, yeah. six. Seven. Here we go. Pop, P, T, C, key. I do not work well with others when it comes to making choreography together, especially when I don't know them because I'm like very dry when I talk sometimes. There is definitely some leadership roles being, you know, taken. <laughs> And that's just kind of, I've noticed how like a lot of hip hop dancers are, and I think it's why they're such great performers, is that they're ready to go on like a moment's fly and like they'll just like take the reins. But it's like, um, hey, we're here too. Don't forget, we also have ballet dancers. We gotta do some ballet I mean, stuff too, sure. guys. I wanted more collaboration. I wanted, I wanted to be like, you know what, challenge me. Like make me do like a, some kind of chart or something. Do you want to do it across the floor? I fake it. I usually fake it. I go. <laughs> I feel like a lot of men are discouraged from doing like ballet, contemporary, modern because it is considered effeminate. And so they turn to hip hop and whatnot. Effeminate qualities are not lesser than a man. They're not, you know, less strong. Just do it from the top to keep it in our minds. I think we should move on. I felt like we needed to go faster. <laughs> I just felt like we spent so much time on like small things. Three, double, four. double, 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 double. Yeah. <laughs> so what one, time is it? Two, nine, <laughs> Do we have enough time to right, break this? Right, right, left, left. <laughs> Boys go back, girls go front. Yes. Yeah. Girls, Five, six, six seven, seven, eight. eight. Oh, girls be girls. Flimish. Wait, Whatever. why girls gotta be girls too? Hold on, yeah, wait a second. Come on. Let's hold on. Yeah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Front line, do what you gotta do. Back line, do what you gotta do. In a lot of the dance world, you're divided by men and women. I identify as a gender non-conforming trans feminine dancer. I do identify with some aspects of femininity. While gender is this big bubble that I don't fully fit in, and so sometimes I can dip in and sometimes I can dip out of what a traditional binary man woman looks like, um, which is why non conforming feels really good for me. Six. Oh, yeah, let's yeah. do that. Yes. yes, okay, cool. 
We have 11 minutes. 11 minutes. I'm tired. <laughs> Even though there was a time limit, I didn't want to rush anything because once we start rushing, we start freaking out. I feel like I'm it so takes longer out. for like professional dancers to come up with stuff than like normal people. Yeah. Dancers just like to like make every count matter. Let's so do wait, it. wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Okay. We're going back to the <laughs> this person saying this thing, this person saying that thing. It was kind of a little bit all over the place. I'm like, all right, well, I'm just gonna like follow along. Freaky, freaky, three I mean, minutes. They... The time, the time. Oh, I hate a time limit. <laughs> There's a minute left. <laughs> okay, wait, actually, hold on. I was like, oh my god, we have a minute left. I don't even know when the end of the dance is. And five, six, seven, eight. Okay. <laughs> um, I was like, how can I fill up the space? Yeah. Ah. Five more minutes? No? Uh. <laughs> before the final performance. I was like, so we're gonna run it a few times? Oh, we're not gonna run it. <laughs> Here we go. I was like, am I gonna look good? It was so stupid. It's not even about that. It's just about having fun and about community and like togetherness. Hit it! That's what I'm talking about. Wait! Okay now, from the beginning. Hit it, boys. From the beginning. I didn't expect this to be what it was. If everyone was like having fun, the energy was right, we were all clicking. Even though at first I got a little nervous, I was able to mellow out and felt that we were all really on top of it and supportive of each other. I have like a very love-hate relationship with ballet, to be honest. Being here today was really special for me because I could remember why I love it and that it's not about being perfect. It's about all of us coming together. I want to just do this on my own. Like, just be like, bring three friends and we're just gonna do a whole 60 second thing to choreograph. I think that's a really cool way to just appreciate people's differences and celebrate them. I feel like dance just unites everyone no matter what your language or background is. And it's just beautiful to see and it's incredible to feel it. Hi everyone, I'm Kenzie and I'm the creator of 60 Second Dance. If you like this episode, make sure you subscribe to Soul Pancake and click here to check out the rest of this series.